Hi, I've just recorded a quick tutorial on how to multiply two digit numbers by two digit numbers. So we're going to use the calculation 34 times by 27. And I am going to set this out in a column format. And if it helps you, you can write in your ones and your tens as your place value column headings. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to write in brackets the calculations that I am going to do first of all. So I'm going to start off with my ones times my ones and I'm going to write in here seven times four. Then going back to my ones and I'm going to write in here seven times 30 because I've then to multiply my ones by my tens. I've multiplied all my ones. So now I'm going to move to my tens column and I need to now multiply my tens by my ones. And then I need to finally multiply my tens by my tens. Okay. Now all I need to do is I need to fill in the blanks because these are all the calculations that I have to work out. So I've got seven times four, which I know gives me 28. So my eight goes in the ones column. My two tens go in the tens column. I then look and I say, right, well, I've got seven times 30 now. Well, I know that seven times three, using my seven times table, is gonna give me 21. Now 30 is 10 times bigger than three. So my answer is going to be 10 times bigger. So my answer is going to be 210. I then look and I think, right, I've now got 20 lots of four. And I know that two times four is eight. And I know that 20 is 10 times bigger than two. So I know that 20 times four is gonna give me 80. So I have zero in my ones column and eight in my tens column. And then finally, I've got 20 times 30. Now, I would start off with two times three, knowing that that is six. And then I think, right, well, I know that 20 times three is gonna be 10 times bigger. So 20 times three is gonna be 60. And I think, but this is 30, so it's gonna be 10 times bigger again. So I know that 20 times 30 is therefore going to be 600. And then I'm gonna add all of these up together and that'll give me my final answer. So I've got eight in here and I have, how many tens do I have? I have 11 tens. So I'll put, and I've got to exchange for a 100. And then I've got two 100s, add six 100s, which give me eight 100s. And then I have to add this extra 100. So I have nine 100s. And my answer is, if you can see, 918.